All right, so we have a donation deck here today. Burn. Uh, before we get into the deck, if you're interested in doing a donation deck at some point, uh, you should head over to my Twitch page, twitch.tv slash EWLandon, and check out the pa panel below the picture, below the video that says donation, and there will be instructions on how to donate and the options for donation decks. So check it out. All right, so today, <coughs> today we have a burn deck that was donated. And there's some interesting choices here. Mostly, it appears we're trying to make room for four light up the stages to gain some some card advantage and draw more burn spells. So that could be an interesting one. Um, only three price of progress. I agree with cutting price of progresses and burn these days because there's too many astrolabe decks and the non astrolabe decks are usually tempo decks and it's the hardest card to, to resolve. Hey, thank you, Ice Philip. Giving me that prime for the holidays, sweet. Um, when I played Burn in the LPL, I actually went down to two price progresses in the main, and I put the other two in the sideboard, which I don't think you even need the two in the sideboard. Bigger Burn. Bigger, bigger Burn. There's also a Wasteland here. I guess this is for uh depths and maybe like glacial chasm or something sideboard is pretty straightforward smashes blasts pyrostatic pillars and some graveyard hate crocus for crystal brand and merit Lage, i would assume anyway so i have played a little bit of burn in the past never had the best results with it but always had fine results with it i always think the next fine one card I really like though is Exquisite Firecraft, since it's uncounterable. It's a really good way to get that last those last points of damage in against the burn decks or against the blue decks. Hey, I still thank you so much. Eight months, awesome, very much appreciated. Thank you. You've never seen Crocus on sideboard. Well, um, I have seen Crocus on sideboard to burn before. Yeah, in my LPL list, I, I played four Exquisite Fire Crafts. But I did not play Light Up the Stage, so I am curious to see how that plays out. Let's see if I can find my the list that I put together for the, L, or for the LPL, yeah. Like Legacy Premier League. Yeah, I had two prices, four Exquisite Fire Crafts. Everything else was real straightforward. All right, let's play. So we can Surgical Dark Depths, yeah. The pronoun. We will play first. This, my friends, is a mulligan. Oh my god. You watched the Patreon BR League and it was sick? Sweet. I'm glad that you enjoyed that. I am planning to do some updates on Patreon this week, a new sideboard guide, because I'm pretty set currently for my reanimator list in the current meta. I don't know how long it'll last, but at least I feel like it's good right now. One, two, three. Well, is this better than a five? This is like a 50-50 for me. We're on the play. I think we keep this on the play. Five is better. Ooh, okay, I agree. Oh my god, this five's great. Unfortunately, if I put two of these on the well, hmm. That's what I was thinking, Orm. Hope we're against. Hope that the deck just loses to the two drop, but we have it here anyway, so that's great. I guess we just put these two on the bottom.
Alright, that's a tropical island. Play around days a little bit here. Like they're probably not gonna daze a lava spike. I could have jammed this into days, but since it kinda sets them back anyway, but then I'm only dealing one point of damage. I might have just got bamboozled by Storm though into not playing my idol on. Hmm. Alright. Since they didn't just play a Charmagoyf here, I think we're gonna win. I don't actually know if we'll win. We only have one card left. Uh oh. We're gonna lose. We're so dead. Nine. Oh, right, we're gonna draw more burn spells. Dark Saga, did you watch the Grixis Delver League as well on on there? Yeah. I'm so glad they just played it to fairy and bounced my haster. Uh, so, <laughs> hmm, this is really interesting because if they daze, I deal an extra two points of damage by playing this first, but if they don't daze, they lose. The game. All right, cool. Yeah, I mean, even if you don't want to play it, I say watch it because you'll get to see some other decks too that I play against. Some, I feel like the league was pretty good. Should be enjoyable. Oh, they're so dead. We we killed them. Who's the combo deck now? Me. I'm the goat combo deck. <laughs> How the hell are we going to beat this deck? These cards, I guess. Teferi seems bad against burn. <laughs> we mulled a five and had a turn four kill. That's pretty sick. I think we actually might be a little slow for this card in this matchup. Cut one. Cut two. Mm. Ah, smash for Ink Moth. I mean, that's their slowest kill, so I feel like we don't want to do that. Because it uses so much mana. I think we're the fast, I don't know. And then they could just counter it. I don't know, I think that's a bad idea. I think we kind of want to cut, light up the stage though. Waste, we have Wasteland too, so. We're on the draw, I can cut a land. Do we just play, try and play the control deck? Ah, yeah, good idea. I thought we were going to be the control deck, but I think you have some valid points here. And then we can bring in like two of these and a uh, two of these. Do we actually want our land though? If we're doing this plan, we can cut a fire blast. Let's fucking try this. Could also cut a price. Let's just try it like this. Yeah, but we don't want to draw multiples. Mm -hmm. 
say it's pretty good. Wong Deck, thanks for the follow. Thank you very much. Now here's the deal, do I... Do you think we we play around the turn two? I mean, do, you, do we just try and kill this now? I feel like we just get greedy. Also, because getting our removal days would be pretty awful. I'm just gonna attack. Nah, I think I'll just let him kill me on turn two if he's got it. I don't have it that often. I only play two berserks. I mean, there's other ways to kill. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. What's up, delicious MT Milf GG? Scale up and invigorate. Yeah, there's a few. If they play scale up, they probably only play one or two if they play any. Oh boy. I mean, I guess I have to bolt it. I have no other way to interact. Maybe I'm supposed to do it on my turn. I like doing it end of turn, but I guess Bolt's pretty bad. This was bad. Maybe I should let that resolve, actually. New plan, use lightning bolt on my turn. New plan, burn the fucking thing. Burn the fucking thing on my turn. I gotta move my chair because I'm like not on camera. What's up guys? Okay. Fuck yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is fine, right? This will be great. Hey. I wish we had a creature. We're so not gonna win because we don't have a creature. Maybe we're supposed to multiply five again. Stop. Yeah.
Three damage. Three mana. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't kill me, bro. I think I waited a turn. This thing is uncounterable, so. Don't do it! Oh my god, what the fuck? Ugh. All right. Our hand was really bad all three games. Let's be real. Actually, our game two, I probably just played badly. Game three, I might have been better off mulliganing again, but I don't think I was beating that hand regardless. They just had... They just had uh, basically a counter for all of our burn spells, even if we were trying to kill their thing, it wasn't going to die. What's up, gentlemen, Finn? What's up, after burn? Standard. Yes, triple invigorate does seem hard to beat. <laughs> Double creature triple invigorate on a mold of five seems pretty good. How all realistic is this game is? Huh? What? What's good? Um, there's a few decks. I've just recently started playing it. I've played a few leagues. The deck that I'm having a little bit of success with, meaning I'm not losing every round, is this uh, Fires of Invention deck. It's actually pretty sweet. Can you VR on this game? No, this is like a card game. You can play this game in paper though. Like you could sit down with cards and sit across from a friend and play it that way. Well, I keep drawing pretty badly, but I feel like I, I keep this one. Yeah, no problem. You never heard of Magic the Gathering? This is the digital version of Magic the Gathering. Are we really playing against the mirror? No, we're playing against, oh, we're so dead. This is fine. We have a goblin guide. How do we lose? Seriously? Mountain Force? Okay. So we're playing against the Astrolabe deck. With no land. Oh, they just kept a mono Force of Will. No, no mana available to them. Is Oko gone in standard? Uh, yeah. To try and hit up Julian about what? What's your most realistic card? I've played Burn. We are drawing pretty bad. I mean, the deck obviously can flood and stuff like that, but... Uh, 
Uh, well, I asked him, and, and did you see the link I sent you? He said to send you the link that he that I sent you. Oh shit, we drew our wasteland. That's pretty good. Well, I just think it's funny they kept a hand with like a basic mountain and no other mana. Yeah, it's on the Patreon. I linked it to you. Shit. What if we drop Rides of Progress? Well. Oh shit, they just gave me a better card. Why didn't they just leave the three damage in my hand? That doesn't make any sense. Is there a bear you can be on in this game? <laughs> I don't know if you're trolling me or not. But it's pretty... I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What if this is Splinter Twin? You're going to change your name to Food is Green? I love it. How did you know it was Splinter Twin? What's going on? What the fuck? <laughs> Is this, am I playing against you right now? They're gonna block? Doesn't that make this thing killable? Yeah, I know. I'm fucking, I'm not killing that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, I mean, I can do this shit at instant speed. Was twin ever, it's a thing people try every once in a while, but no. I mean, just think about it. As far as combos go, you can't have a worse combo in, in Legacy. Because you're playing bad creatures and, and a do-nothing enchantment compared to... And it's like a turn four combo. While most of the combos in Legacy are much more efficient or powerful. Or faster, I mean. I only play two games. Fortnite and EverQuest with my dad. You've missed so much. Where have you been? Burn spell. Fuck. <laughs> it certainly appears we're playing against Splinter Twin, yes. Or we're just playing against Deceiver Exarch. Oh shit, I shouldn't be attacking with this. It's gonna draw them lands. Hey, Arkin with the host. Thank you so much. How was your stream? I'm sure I'm talking to you not being here yet because it takes time. But when you get here, thank you. And how was your stream? Sometimes my dad makes me pick up flowers for his Elder Scrolls game. Your dad sounds cool, man. Reduke was playing Reanimator versus Arkin. I lost to Reduke yesterday. That's the first time I've lost to him. He's been playing Legacy.
I need to see something here. Did they keep? No shuffle. Brainstorm. Or preordain. Back from Bologna. I had fun stream, but I punted versus Duke last game. Even he drew very well. Hey, laugh side D, subscribe tier one. Three months in a row. Thank you so much. Congrats on the finish in the GP. Thank you. Much appreciated. How are you doing? I'm glad people have not forgotten about me, even though I didn't stream for like two weeks. All right, let's go. Get a freaking dual land. You know you want to. No. They don't want to. Orm's over there shaking his head about me fucking casting that shit. I mean, way sanding their only dual land. Are they really just gonna take this? You're gonna take it? That's a good one. This is the card I said we should cut almost completely from the deck. And this card is so bad right now. This could be a... What did I have there? I had a Skewer the Critics. Oh, we would have won. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But these light up the stages have been really nice. I built Dredge after watching your stream. Awesome. The one where I forewarned? Are you talking to Orin where he's like the Dredge Master? I feel like Dredge is really good. They built the Dredge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We played close to that. The Neonates are really actually pretty good. Orin, have you tried the, the this Dredge list? With Insulet Neonate? That card was impressive to me. Can we even play this fucking thing? Three, four, five. Yeah, I guess we can. There it one. What the fuck? What the fuck? Play a land, any land, any land, any fetch land, anything. Burn, burn, burn. You've got to be kidding me. The fuck? If I went with a different fire I just lost. Kind of cool. Yeah, the Neonites are much better than I thought they would be. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. They played a fucking... Oh, my God. <laughs> they should have known that was what was in my hand. No! Alright. Man, we're so good at burn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what was the punt? God damn it, Orm.
Yeah, playing Burn. Okay. But what if he had a force of will in his hand? Oh, never mind. I don't know. Punt. Whatever, I won, so uh, obviously not a punt. Smash for their astrolabes? Uh, I'm not even positive they're playing it, so I'm not gonna do that. They almost certainly are, but they might side them out too. Maybe not. I don't know. Also, I think I'm looking for cards to cut, not cards to bring in at this point. Alright. Smash your lives. It's just like one of the one of those things that could be good sometimes, but Rather just all my spells just steal three, right? This hand seems pretty good. No creature. Uh, this is a donation deck, gentleman Finn. So how is your experience with the uh, dredgeman so far? Man, they're taking so much damage off these shock lands. I mean, these <laughs> fetch lands. <laughs> They've shocked themselves off their fetches. All right, let's take a look. They did not shuffle. Uh oh. These are the best hands against counter spell decks because there's no spells worth countering. Oh, now there are though. That's kind of a bummer. Right. Hamilton today with my test group. Neonate is really cool. Yeah. Agreed. What? Oh. Why are they? Why did they wait for this to resolve? Oh, okay, I see. I thought they were gonna swords it. I was like, why did they let it grow? Like it looked like they purposely let that resolve. And then they were gonna swords it. Why did they get? Blue? I don't understand. I thought for sure they were swordsing. Because otherwise, wouldn't you just get a basic? Maybe they have a a white creature spell? A white spell? <laughs> Remembering triggers Jarvis head desk. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Oh shit. Oh shit. I played the old list without neonates, fells. It's about one turn too slow against Sneak and Show, Turbo Daps, and Storm. Um, I think it's not faster, no. I think uh, Sneak and Show should be a, a good matchup. Depths is a bad matchup, and Storm is a close matchup. Yeah, Orm's got the plan here. Draw more LEDs. I mean, it is like a turn one and two combo.
man, they're just fetching up. They knew they knew we've sighted out those force those uh, they knew that we saw like a million fucking basics and we'd sight out the price of progresses. And now they're like they're, sh they're teaching me a lesson. By the way, Eric, how ended drinking night with Honor Rock? <laughs> yeah, we, we made it fine. Thanks for looking out. The reason I cast that is because Dove and Fido was down. And like snap fluster or whatever. If anybody was wondering. Oh no. I know. Fluster storm, like what? Uh, maybe I'm supposed to attack this fucking thing. Shit. One point. <coughs> I think I was supposed to attack the fairy there. Let's go. Burn spells. Fuck yeah. I lost to Reed Duke yesterday. I think he's been playing a bit of Legacy. It's the first time I've lost to him, though. I think I'm like 2-1 against him. But. Bummer. B -b 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 Bummer. Yesterday, he was playing a Bug Delver deck, I guess. Bug, bug something. Bug. Aren't there a bunch of videos like that? Unban Mental Misstep? Burn Spell. Click me. Ooh, baby. I think my record against Mangucci, realistically, is like fifteen and three. But he's always playing, you know, random stuff. I've never played a serious match against him.
They would have countered that. Right? Yeah. Oh, that would have been such a bummer to draw. I should have not decided that in, apparently. Yes. Or at the Pro Tour, Chili Yes. See, that's why I want you guys to agree to watch me to watch me playing standard. But I'm pretty sure everybody's gonna leave if I start playing standard. But there's a Grand Prix coming up next week. And I'd like to do well in it. <laughs> I know everybody will leave there's enough people here right now that I'll just keep playing legacy I'd have to pay you guys the new the newest standard set's not so bad I think it's kind of I mean the newest standard for, uh, meta is pretty good Register mono red with no testing. Fires feels like a legacy deck, kind of. Yeah, that's what I'm playing this Fires. Feels like a combo deck. It's pretty sweet. I like it. I tried the Flash, Simic Flash deck as well. That deck also seems very sweet. Uh, but I don't have enough experience in standard to know how to play counter spells well. It's hard to do threat assessment. You end up falling behind if you, if you feel like... I don't know. It's easy to, to not play well with counter magic. I will keep playing Legacy for now. Anybody here going to uh, to the Magic Fest Portland? It's, a, it's like a Grand Prix in my hometown. I have to go. And I want to do well. I'd like to do well. I have a buy. Magic Quest Spartan's on the 20th, so in like 11 days. Do you like Bug or Grixis more? I, I like Grixis. Not close. I'm not a fan of Delver decks without Lightning Bolt, really. Um... You could play Cage and Grixis. Or you could just play Ley Lines. You know, if you're worried about graveyard decks, just put Ley Lines in your deck. Build it like this. Uh, yeah. Either three ley lines or or four, something like that. You like bug more, I mean, how many brazen bars are you playing? I don't know, I've, I've never lost to depths with Grixis Delver, or maybe I did once. So I'm like X and O or X and 1 with at least 10 plus matches against it, including the good players. Yeah. 
Shadow Knight's good. I don't know. I, I mean, I'm not going to build it like this, so I didn't put a lot of thought into it right now, but if if I was playing a lot of graveyard decks, I would just play four ley lines because you're not going to beat Dredge or Hogak consistently enough with Surgicals and Crypts. But you could just do like one, two, three. Three ley lines. Call it good. Just fucking mulligan to it. Veil is huge versus Brazen. I mean, not if they don't have any mana. <laughs> I don't know. I just, like, stifle their fetch lands and wasteland their green sources, their bayous and shit, and then they just die. And then you just Brazen Borrow or their thing. You just don't let them set that shit up. Yes, Hogak is surprisingly, well, not that surprisingly, all, all their creatures, they have a lot of annoying pesky creatures, so Surgical's not very good against them. Yes, I mean, if they're playing a lot of Goyfs, that could be a problem, but I mean, you should leave in all your removal. So you have Fatal Pushes and Dreadhorde Arcanist, you can beat Goyf pretty easily, it's a slow, bad creature. No! Mally Mujo. Why? I, I don't think I've ever won a die. I don't usually care about die roll wins, but I think I've never beat Mally Mujo in the die roll. That bastard. I got to meet Mally Mujo in Bologna, and it made, made my life. Made me very happy. Let's go. You're gonna daze this. No daze, we're so dead. Who is this? I beat them yesterday, but I don't know what they were playing. This is Mally Mujo. This is the original trophy king of, of Legacy. Mally Mujo is amazing. I, I met him. He's a cool dude. He's from Croatia. This shit flipped. I feel like I kill it. My hand is stacked. I know it's usually wrong, but my hand is fucking stacked. So I'm gonna do it. I feel like it's the only way I lose is if they kill my shit. Bolt the burb. Shit. That is another way I lose. Do I just uh, go all in on this fire blast? You think I'll draw lands? Pulse of Marasa, thank you for the follow. What is the oh no no and then I would have just died We're gonna win. We can take a couple hits here. No! Shit. Surprisingly good. I guess it's just, it's not that good. I guess he's planning to counter stuff. I know what he's playing. 
Could have double days. All right. Maybe I was supposed to fire this off. I guess if anything gets countered, I lose, so. <laughs> Just draw a thing. What? It has to be a good thing, though. It has to be that exquisite firecraft that's on my sideboard. Okay. Let's fucking go. Let's go. Don't have force. Yeah! <laughs> I love burn. I beat Malamuja. All right, we have to win another game, though. I shouldn't get too excited. Actually, I think he's... I don't know if he's playing my list or not, but it looks like he's playing Grixis Delver, and that's a pretty, pretty bad matchup. Or burn's a bad matchup for Grixis Delver. Stopping at three lands like Burn Master. Hell to the yes. Hell to the yes. What do we bring in? I just cut a card, but I don't see anything to bring in. Alright. No cuts. Deck's perfect. Literally. The nut. Oh shit, look at that. Oh sh shit. Oh, I'm gonna fucking wasteland him and he's gonna lose his mind. He's gonna lose his mind. He's gonna go, what the fuck just happened? Boom. You just play one. You just play one wasteland to get him. Shit. Didn't work. I think I just fed his Gurmag Angler and now I'm gonna lose. Wow. I'm also just drawing mono creatures, which is the best. Well, Pice of Progress sucks. Played around wasteland with more lands. I know. What the fuck, right? Some bullshit. Oh. Wow. And then I'm gonna play Goblin Guy and he's gonna not have a land on top because uh he brainstormed. Or he's just gonna daze me, but whatever, I have more creatures. There's no way. No! 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 How did he know? Shit. What's up, Aced1430? It's going. It is going. How you doing? How you doing?
Got it. All right, let's see. I drew so many creatures, how do I lose? I don't think I can lose. Fatal push, okay. Fatal push means it's less likely he's Gurmag angling me. Shit, that's how we lose. What? It's such a Malamujo card. I think we win. We're out of cards. Now they have invasive surgery. How do we win? All of our shit is dead. All of our shit is dead and all of our spells are countered. Well, at least, at least he's invasive surgery the worst spell in my deck. I don't know, I guess we lose. <laughs> How do we lose? We have a goblin guide. That's so annoying that he has that. We drew a bolt. Oh my god, that's a lot of wastelands. Champion. Can we go back and talk about invasive surgery? What do we want to talk about? That it only counters sorceries? I mean, I think you just... I would agree. If he has it in the sideboard, he should bring it in. You have to counter everything. We, we play eight sorceries. If you don't count that, we play four, eight, no, we play more than eight, 12, 14, okay? Surgery has applications. I don't I don't put it in my sideboard, but I cannot fault Mali Mudra for putting it in the sideboard. It it counters a lot of important spells in Legacy. There's just like probably more powerful options. Can Burn beat Oko? Yeah. Well No. No. Burn can't beat Oko. I mean, you could beat Oko Dex. <laughs> you can kill... You can kill them with Oko in play. No problem. This deck is a turn three combo deck. No problem. I have to go to the bathroom. I'm going to throw in an ad, and then I'll be right back in, like, well, the ad's a minute. I'll be back in, like, a minute as well. Thanks for waiting.
Oke. Okay. But I just mean turn two timer go to block. Uh no, I mean you cannot beat a nut draw from a from an Oko deck. You can barely beat Tarmogoyf with Burn anyway. Like, that card's good enough against you. Can anything beat a nut draw? I mean, reanimator. Reanimator nut draws beat every other nut draw. You guys like my new shirt? I bought this from an artist on uh, on Twitter who happened to be a friend of a friend of mine. I should shout out the artist, but I have to look them up. I'll shout them out next time. Shout out to the artist who made this t-shirt. See if I can find it. While we wait. Alex Cahill. An imperfect dude. And now basic swaps wants to play in face of surgery. Talking mad shit. Now you're like, I gotta put that card in my deck. Alright, check it out. This is the artist who made the shirt, and apparently he's gonna be doing a series of uh of different uh, legacy decks. This is pretty tight. There's also a uh a hoodie. Alright, well, enough of that. Anim Perfect Dude on Twitter. Everybody's scared. Delver shirt. The flavor of Delver is probably like the lamest of most decks. I, I heard he's going to do Death and Taxes. And then another, I can't remember the other one. You don't want to play against Burn? This is going to be basic swamps. He's trying to give me the almost perfect league. Is it time for an Astrolabe plus Veil ban yet? Why? Shit. Snap you. Shit, we lost the die roll. Man, this hand sucks. I have to keep it though. Delver. Should I just wasteland him? Trying to think. He's gonna have more lands, right? <laughs> Alright, so if as long as the thing doesn't flip, wastelanding's fine, I think.
frack. <laughs> He's gonna draw land. It doesn't have lands! Oh my god, he doesn't have lands! Oh, he's so dead. I'm gonna kill this, I think. And play an Eidolon? No. Let's see. No flip. Maybe if it doesn't flip, I don't kill it. No flip, no land. Shit. That's a wasteland. <laughs> Honestly, if your only way to win in Legacy is to manage for your opponent, you should play at Casual Rooms. I'm going to kill it because we have like all this card advantage and stuff. Force, force, force. Ma Shit. 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 Oh, that's kind of good. Five ten. Might be able to win this one. We're a little bit behind. If he forces this, we're dead. We need this thing to deal like. <laughs> four damage, so attack once and just draw a thing. Do a thing. Sir Sethers, thanks for the uh the follow. Alright, don't bolt me, bro. Actually I shouldn't F6 because if he bolts me I have to try and fire blast. Alright, let's draw another thing. Let's draw a thing. Thing, thing, thing. Draw a thing. It's not a thing. He can bolt me. Bolt. No. If 
I only didn't lose all of my lands. I don't understand. So I think we're playing against Grixis Delver, not, um, not, whatchamacallit, Mint Fair decks, yeah. And the, I, I think this deck's okay against Combo. It's pretty bad against Reanimator and Dredge, but it's good against Storm. I guess it's bad, horrible against Stone Tall. Okay, it's good against Storm and really bad against all the other Combo decks. Dredge, yeah, I can see that. Same with Reanimator. But even then, it's still a good matchup for Reanimator. You just cite in your answers to that card. Hey, thanks, Hackbert. You're welcome. Glad that you enjoy it. That's not true, Orem. Well, no, I don't think it's a bad matchup. I think it's close. Cyrus, I I've heard many other Stormer players agree. Burn is not a bad, not that good of a matchup. Storm 50-50, that sounds more like it. So far, it's been really good. I don't know if it's better than the spells that we've uh, replaced it with, but... I disagree, Aurum. If the burn player is good, it's probably 50 50. Just empty. Okay. There aren't many sideboard cards in here for burn. love this play but the other it's either that or just pass so here comes the Grimag Angler I'm at, he's at 17 uh oh Why are Horizon Lands not in Legacy Burn, but they are in Modern Burn? Well, mo Modern Burn plays more than one color, first of all. Second of all, uh, you could play them, but Legacy is a bit too fast, I think. Burn should be pretty heavily favored against any con blue control deck. I forgot to block. Oh yeah, Fire Blast is a thing too. Also Price of Progress. Tap? Tap? Eh? He's not tapping his wasteland, is he? And I guess he's going to plan to counter this one. True name? Yes, we're on four light up the stage. Cheesehead. Wow. This is another Gurmag? Oh, this is Gurmag. 
Huh. Interesting. Okay. Wasn't as impressed. It seemed fairly good to me so far, but uh, I think we're super dead. Huh. Really? I think, yeah, or Tess is, Tess is not the deck I'm talking about. Tess could just race Eidolon every time, pretty much. But Tess is just Belcher. Yeah, I really like the Exquisite Fire Cups. I kind of feel like you want four of those. But I think you could just cut Price of Progress for the light up the stages. Price of Progress is not very good. Everything can lose to Burn Orm, especially these decks that lose to themselves all the time. Come on. I think I want creatures. This hand seems bad. Um, okay. This hand's also bad. Shit. I should have kept the first hand and wastelanded him. I don't care if he days is this. The who isn't what's important. What's important is if you feel like you have a better deck to donate, you're, it's always an option. What? Is Pillar good here? I don't think Pillar's good against Delver, no. Are you not entertained? That's a good point. All right, let's draw a freaking burn spell here. Burn! Yes! The nuts! The goddamn nuts! I should probably stop making light. No, I'm making lane drops is fine. Let's go. Let's go. Stop forcing my spells. God damn it. I know. It's ridiculous. All right, he's at six. How do we lose? He's going to ponder into a bolt, maybe, or something. We just need two things, and then he's dead. Or we just need Price of Progress. The card said it's bad. It's good against Delver.
You can't do that. Oh. Don't I get a... Seems like a bad idea. You don't want to do that. <laughs> you don't want to copy that shit. Oops. Everybody did it once. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Otis. All right. That is a mistake you only make once. It's like the surgical mistake. <laughs> What's up, Basic Swamps? That, those were close games. Those were close games. <laughs> yeah, somebody in chat said that's a mistake you only make once. Bedlam. I don't know if you want that card in. Eh, it seems okay. I don't know. The surgical mistake is where you cast surgical and you don't take the card out of the targeted card out of the graveyard. Yeah. Those stifles fine because it hits uh, a couple things, but yeah, Thoughtseize is pretty bad. There aren't many things in the sideboard, like you mentioned. Stiblets the suspend, counters the suspend spell, which is a free bolt. Could also potentially hit a prowess trigger. Oh, we're playing against this again? Isn't this what we lost to? I mean, they could be playing something else. I will say the stream sniping thing is something that that insanity that you experience as a new streamer it yeah it happens to literally every streamer it seems like where you're like holy shit it seems like everybody's stream sniping hey so i don't i guess they're on bant not um not infect they could still be on infect but they probably would have cast something by now if they were bolt the dark nah we gotta bolt their face we're gonna bolt their fucking face <laughs> i didn't even i just like that's just that's fine, Wizomatic. That's not even why I was talking about it. I was talking about it because Basic Swamps was just saying he quit streaming because of stream snipers. <laughs> but that's kind of funny. Snapcaster Mage. Actually... This price of progress is looking pretty good. It's already four damage. I've just built my new PC and I'm thinking about starting streaming myself around the holidays. Cool. Do it. 
Hey! <laughs> hey, another fucking... Another fucking goblin guide. Let's just draw all the goblin guides. I'll bolt this. You need a decent PC to stream smoothly, but not it doesn't have to be insane. Oh no. Oh fuck. There's an Oko on top of their deck. And they had another Force of Will. I guess this game's over. God damn. Uh, <laughs> you can make all the make all the suggestions you want. In my list that I played in the LPL, I had two searing blood in the sideboard. Se Searing Blaze is not good in a deck with 20 mountains. Searing Blood is medium, but it's probably better than Searing Blaze. Oh, we're still in it, Arkin. We are still in it. Yeah, we're three one. Shit. Uh. All right. Yes, I'm gonna just do one blast. Wasteland, Wasteland, Price of Progress. All right, this this hand's a keep. How do we lose? the actual worst draw. Alright, I'm just going to concede.
All right. Well, we beat the three fair blue decks where the opponent didn't say, sorry, I'm in your chat, I'll leave now. <laughs> and uh, we lost to Infect. Which felt... I think game two, I made a mistake. Yes, Price of Progress. Well, Price of Progress was especially bad there, but... Yeah, no problem. TD Chess, victory with burn. Let's open it. I just thought it was funny because I was responding to basic swamps about his comment on not having fun streaming because of stream snipers. And then you said, oh, sorry, I didn't realize you were on. I'll leave now. <laughs> I wasn't I, I wasn't even commenting on you being in chat. I wasn't even looking or noticing. But as soon as you said that, it, yeah. Um, doesn't matter. He had the actual worst. No, I had a chance if that vortex had resolved. I guess he probably drew the Force of Negation because I would think he would cast that on the Bolt since I just lose to Batter Skull. Unless, I mean, I don't know. Alright, anyway, thanks for watching, YouTube.